All right, Timpal LFX 13, and I'm gonna be showing you five oil analysis um, from Virgin Oils. Uh, starting from the left, you'll see the Penzil Platinum 5W20, then the Ultra Platinum from the same company, 5W20, then the Amsoil 5W20, Castrol Edge 5W20, and the one that's not there, it's a Valvoline uh, Synthetic. So here are the results. I, um, let's see if I, there's less glare here. Uh, let's go see the metals, um, except for a Penzil Platinum with one PPM every body score zero on the board. Chromium, zero on the board. Nickel, Amazol boosted as one, the rest are zero. Uh, for aluminum, um, except for Ultra and Boosted, everybody has one. Valvoline has two. Copper, everybody's at zero. Lead, uh, the only one with one ppm is the Amsoil Boosted. Tin, uh, Amsoil Boosted has two. Ultra has one, the rest is zero. And uh, Cadmium Silver and Vanadium, everybody has zero on the scoreboard. For contaminants, um it's pretty mixed uh penzoils are the same with three amsoil boosted as five so have ppm of silicone castrol as four valvoline as five uh, for sodium wise uh penzoil ultra and boosted as two the rest are zero potassium uh amsoil as zero potassium contaminant the rest as one now for the multi-source metal, that's where we we start to see change. Uh, pretty much uh, almost non-existent for everyone. Penzoil has two, and Valvoline, that's rare, but uh, I see 34 titanium uh, parts per million on their oil. Uh, this is very different. It's one of the only oils I see with it. Uh, I still have to test uh, one of the Castro Edge titanium, which... I should do in a few weeks. Uh, and Tommy, every, everybody's at zero except uh, Penzial Ultra with two. Now, Molly B. Molly B here. Uh, the lowest is Penzial Platinum with 52. And the IS is Ultra with 89. But it's pretty uh, tight here. Pretty much all the same uh, quantities. I'm so boosted at 77. Uh, basically... Uh, Higher than Valvoline and Penzoil Platinum, but a lower from Ultra and a little lower from the Castrol Edge. Uh, manganese, everybody at zero. Lithium, everybody at zero. That's good. Boron, uh, that's where usually we separate the men from uh, the little uh, scout girls. Uh, platinum has two. The Ultra has two sixty-three, which is very good. Everything over two hundred is good. Amazon boost 231. Castrol uh, was opening a little bit more. 72. Valvoline, uh, very good with 246. Uh, that's an interesting um, overall recipe for Valvoline here. Uh, for the additives, um, since I cover already the Pencil Planium Ultra and Boosted on another video, I'll just move to Castrol and Valvoline. Uh, Castrol takes the case with magnesium, 1465 versus 800 for the Valvoline. Um, basically, Castrol has the highest of them all. Valvoline is in the middle of the pack, just uh, behind the Amsoil Boosted. Calcium, uh, again, the, that Penzoil Platinum takes the cake. I mentioned that earlier. Uh, Amsoil Boosted is the second in line, then the Ultra. Valvoline at fourth with 1017 and Castrol 643. Barium zero, so nobody has smoke suppressor uh, additives in there. Phosphorus, uh, pretty much even. If, um, you know, uh, the Penzoil Ultra is the only one in the 600 with 642, but uh, look at the others, they're all over 700. Uh, 730 for the boosted, 741 for the Castrol. 734 for Valvoline, so you very comparable to the boosted and platinum at 718. So the zinc, that's a very good additive also to have. Um, 
but if you are have a convert converter catalytic, uh, it needs to be under 966. Over that, uh, there's a good chance it uh, screws your converter. So zinc here, uh, casserole again, a good and the valvoline very similar with 808, 801. So uh, most of them are all over 800. Penzo Ultra at 754. Uh, now, if we look at the CST, the vis viscosity for 100 degrees Celsius, which is 212 Fahrenheit, I think. Um, 875 for the Castro, so basically on par with the Amsoil Boosted. Uh, higher than the Platinum, but lower than the Ultra. And the lowest of them all is Valvoline with uh, 7.63. And the flash point, as I could say, the pencil platinum is was high earlier with 450. I'm sure the ultra is the same or higher. And same thing with the Amsoil should be very similar to the Pennzoil. Uh, but Castrol and Valvoline are still good with 425 and 420 is very good. But because I seen 400 and 385, the lowest on the, uh, I think I seen the 385 on a 0W20, but I could be wrong. So that's it. Uh, I hope you find this informative for those who wanted to know, um, you know, what the oil sample from these virgin oil uh, oils, basically what it is. So take care and have a nice day.